Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to WISRP. I mean Diggy's van man, I'm trying to find him man again. He's he's missing again. I figured I'd drive his van because he's probably walking. So I'm, I'm gonna go try to find him with some short. Sure. See if he's at my house. He might be at my house, we'll go check. Just looking around because you know he could be anywhere, man. I don't know. I don't know where he went. We went to jail and I seen him for a month. It's been like four months now. I need to get rid of that fence and just keep it down. Let's see if he's in the house. Hey, Diggy. Where you at, man? Are you up here, man? Yo, you in the bathroom? Oh, no, shit. I don't know where he's at, man. He's not at my house. Shit. Let's go check the yellow jack. He might be there. I know he's not at this bar because he doesn't like Becky because that the, the girl Becky, he spit on her or whatever. And then the cops had called and I showed up and him and Ricky were here and then I, I don't know what was going on that night. There's a lot of nonsense I can tell you. Especially the other night when they came in and tried to you know, take my, uh, like, search the house. That was bullshit, saying it's in about weed. That, that was fucked up. Uh, yeah, let's go check the yellow jack, man. Might have to get some gas here. Yeah, let's get some gas. But we're gonna go check the yellow jack, man. That should be good enough. Get the now. Oh, whoops, my bad. Good thing you don't gotta clean it up. Get some gas. And he always leaves it like kinda empty, man. He never he never fills it up, but I, I always fill it up. I mean, technically, when he's in sleeping in my van, I mean I don't fill it up, but he's got so I, I mean I, I I guess it's vice versa type deal, you know. Alright. Further up. Let's go check the yellow check. He might be at the yellow check, man. Might have to go see. It's pretty nice though. Let's try it on the windows, man. Fucking pigs back there. Fucking pigs. Yeah, let's go see if he's at the yellow jack. Because I know he's not at the bar downstairs. He doesn't like that bartender anymore. He could barely stand Sandra, but at least Sandra is not like snitching anymore. She actually likes to have our business since there's a new bar in town. Now she's got a competition. Yo, what the fuck? What the fuck? No, I was, I was fucking driving the fucking ass out. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Hopefully that gap didn't see me. 
Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. What the fuck's going on? 732, we're gonna be on 10. Oh shit. Fuck. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, it's going good, man. Oh, pretty good. You got license registration proof insurance on you? Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. You want my license, man? Yeah, license registration and proof insurance, please. Oh, can I ask what's going on first? Yeah, I'll go ahead and let you know once you give me that information. Alrighty. Jeez, Make you flowers, man. Alrighty, Mr. Flowers. Could you go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, please? Uh, step out of the vehicle? Why? Yes, please. Uh, is there any, is there any weed inside the vehicle, sir? I mean, no. I, I smoked like early, early this morning, like like okay. f five hours ago. I mean, okay. it may, right. I may smell like weed, but I'm, I'm sober now. Okay, no worries. Go ahead and hop out for me. Uh, all right, man. Thank you. All right, just come back over here while I chat. Hey, right, man. There's nothing in the vehicle I need to be concerned about because I'm smelling a heavy odor of narcotics coming from that vehicle. I mean, I don't know. It's my brother's van. He, he's been missing. Like, we went to Joe like three months ago, and then, like, the first month I seen him, but then he's been missing, and I had been trying to find him, so I've been driving his van around. I mean, I don't know what he has exactly in there. Okay. Well, you understand that once you set foot behind the driver's seat, you are, you are now the primary the person that is in control of what is inside that vehicle. Oh shit. Yep, so no matter what is inside that vehicle, you should know about now. And that is underneath your control. Oh, I mean, I don't so, I don't really know. I mean, yeah. it's pretty messy in there, so I mean. No, I get you. So since Um, yeah, so since I do smell a heavy odor of marijuana, um I am going to go ahead and search the vehicle. I have probable cause due to the odor of mar marijuana, so I am going to go ahead and uh search it. If I find anything, then we'll go from there, okay? Hey, right, man. <laughs> oh shit, fuck. There's another one showing up? Fuck.
Alrighty. So What's going I did on, find man? a couple of baggies, empty empty baggies of weed. Um, but it looks like they were smoked way too long ago for me to eat for me to even identify. Um, and you do also have an open container in there. I'm not too concerned about that. Um, but definitely get that thrown out because I could throw you throw you in for that, but I'm not going to. Um, I mean, I mean, I don't. Old. I mean, this is his house technically, so I mean, I don't want to throw it out because he keeps his food no, and everything I, in here. I get you, but um, you can't be having open open containers of alcohol inside of a vehicle. No, I mean, I'm not drinking because I, I'm on parole. No, I, I get you, and that's why I'm not why I'm not coming down on you about it. Okay. All right, man. All right. Um, I believe my officer needs to tell me something regarding something else. Um. Uh, one second, we'll talk. Um, so go ahead and sit down with me and then I'm gonna go have a chat with him, okay? Alrighty, man. Fuck. Fuck. You're stressed out, man. Uh. All right. What's going on, man? All right. Well, um, reason for the stop today, we had nine one one stating that you were looking for drugs around the, I believe that is twenty four seven all the way on two seven one. If I'm mistaken, I'm not quite sure exactly. Oh, the that. the Ace Liquor. The Ace Liquor, yeah. I mean, allegedly, I'm just going to say that. Okay. Alright, so you are admitting to it then, correct? I said allegedly. Okay, so let's say allegedly you were doing that. Let's not do that again. I'm not going to push anything on to you about this. Let's just go ahead and keep it civil. Keep it to your own. If you, let's not do hardcore narcotics. Blah, 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 blah. You've heard this in elementary school. I'm not going to repeat myself. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. So, I mean, I'm really, I'm really just any. out looking for my brother, to be honest with you, man. Okay. All right. Well, before you take off again. You guys haven't seen him, have you? No, we haven't. He's not in jail, is he? Usually when he goes missing, he's in jail, or he might have a warrant out for his arrest. Hopefully he doesn't have a warrant. What's his name? Dickie Cheese. C-H-E-E-Z. -E he does? Yeah. For what? Damn. Alright, but if you are going to keep continuing to look for him, let's get those ba empty baggies of weed out of there. Let's get that open container out of there before you take off again, okay? Yeah, I could do that, man. I was... Alright. Alrighty. Well, I'm just going to let you go with the verbal warning. Let's just not do that again. Don't worry about what I just pulled out. Um, and let's just get you on out of here, okay? Alrighty. Alrighty, you have a better rest of your night. Alrighty, too. Fucking pig.
Fuck off. Fuck piece of shit. Wanna let me throw my trash away? I'm just doing what the fuck the cops told me to do, man. Don't make throw my fucking trash away. The fuck? The fuck am I getting pulled over for? Fuck. The fuck is this fucking cop doing, man? What did I find? I didn't do anything. Just did what they told me to do. They threw the fucking stuff out. Clean his car, man. Fuck. Oh, yeah, another one's showing up? Are you fucking serious, man? What the fuck? Where's the fucking dicky when I fucking need him, man? Because I get trumped up with fucking charges, man. Fucking hassled. I mean, even Ricky, man, my cousin. I'd like to have him around, too. Is this some fucking bullshit? Ricky! Yeah, hey, what's going on, man? Go ahead, step out. Step out? For what? Mm -hmm. We'll have a chat about that once we're out of the vehicle. We can have a chat in here. I... Nope. Ricky. What? Go ahead and step out. I didn't do anything. I just did what you guys we'll told go me. Ahead and explain everything I, I, I did what you did. I cleaned it. I cleaned out I the know. van. I know. But I'm gonna need you to step out of the vehicle now. You guys are kind of scaring me. It's all right. I'm gonna need you to step out of the vehicle, please. What if I don't? You are. Put it this way: you're gonna be in more trouble if you don't step out. I feel like I'm already in trouble. I didn't do anything wrong. I did exactly what you asked. No, I just I just threw the trash away like you guys told me to, man. I know, but nah. I mean, if you tell me what it is, I might step out. Well, at this point, I can't tell you until you're out of the vehicle. Well, if you tell me, I'll step out. I mean, well, if I, I mean, did, if you I got two options. I can either rip you out of the vehicle, or you're gonna step out for willingly. <laughs> rip me out? You ain't gonna rip me out. I mean, I'm out of here, man. Talk about you gonna rip me out. You ain't gonna rip me out. Talk about they gonna rip me out. You ain't ripping me out. You gonna rip me out? I didn't do anything.
Holy shit. Shit, I think I'm gonna go back to my house. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Back. No. Back. Hold on, hold on. Mickey, can you hear me? Leave me alone, man. I'm scared. Right, Mickey. Mickey, it's just me. Listen to me. I'm gonna talk this out, okay? I'm scared, man. I know. Hey, I'm scared too. But, but Mickey, do you have any guns or anything on you? No, man. I don't got no guns. I don't want to go to jail, man. I know. Hey, Mickey, it's Marshall Greasy. Remember me? What's going on, Greasy? Hey, man, I don't want this to end up like Dickie, man. What happened to Dickie, man? Just everything that he's just been MIA, man. I don't, want, I don't want you to end up like that and, or worse, end up dead, man. Why don't you just come out and talk to us? I don't want to go to jail, man. I'm scared. I can't find him. He apparently, he's got a warrant out for his arrest. Hey, oh, man. Come on. Hey, yeah, what's I got, up? I got bang bangs. Bang bangs? No, 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 no. No, no, no bang bangs. Mickey, Mickey, come on, man. Just come on out. We'll we'll, we'll be easy on you. I promise. You're Give not, my word. You're not going to put me in cuffs, are you? I'm tired of those things. I can't promise that, but at this time, you, you won't be taken to jail. I just need you to come out so you can talk to us. So if I leave, you're promising I won't go to jail? Yeah. Now, yeah. now you got quiet there for a minute. I don't believe you guys. All right, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. No, no, hey, Mickey. It's, it's all right, man. It's Officer Panko. Remember me? Me and Greasy talked. Yeah, I remember. But yeah, man. I when... when when have myself and Greasy ever done you wrong, buddy? Just come on out, come speak with us. Right? Well, well, why did why did it take you so long to answer that question, though? Uh, man, I just got I just I just got up here, Thank my man. No, Williams, Williams, no. Williams, no. I'm hey, I'm scared. I know, Mickey. Do you care if Mickey. myself and Greasy come in there and come speak with you? I mean, if you come in, I guess. Hey man, can you go ahead and unlock the door? I don't know. I, should I trust you guys? Hey, hey it'll just be us. myself and Greasy that'll come inside there, boss man. All right, I want you to put your tasers up. I I ain't got nothing in my hands but but a candy bar. A candy bar? Yeah, hey, do you want a candy bar? Up on my nah. Seat, so you don't Does have it got weed in there? Does it what? I'm sorry. Does it got weed in there? No, man, I, I no, I don't have a weed candy bar, but hey, can you come unlock this door for us? Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm going to peek out. 
Yep. They're fine, where? I... I don't want to play Yeah. Hey, you know, and I see guns. No. How? No, don't worry, don't worry. Don't no, worry about no them. Guns. No guns out. Mickey, come on, man. Just unlock the doors. Let us come in and talk to you. Just me and Deputy Chief Pat and the other dude. You, uh, all right. I'm, I'm, no, I only want Greasy in here. Well, that's fine. All right. Is this door unlocked, Mickey? Come in, man. See, Mickey, it's just me. I don't see anyone, man. Oh, you're in the bathroom? Is this door unlocked? I'm in the bathroom. I unlocked it, man. Hey, buddy. What's going you on, You got nothing man? to worry about, man. I, I just want to know, like, wh what happened? I don't know. Uh, the cops the cops allegedly pulled me over. Someone must have called the cops to me for trying to buy drugs or something. I wasn't trying to buy no drugs, so I don't know what that was about. And then I did what they asked me. I cleaned Dickie's van. I got all of his weed baggies out of there. I got his empty containers and half empty containers. He's going to be kind of pissed because there were some expensive battles in there. I threw all his porn magazines out. I cleaned the van. It's 100% clean. But then, like, apparently I cl after I cleaned it, I left. And then the cops were pulling me over saying that I need to step out. I didn't do anything, man. Were you driving Dickie's van? Yeah, because I'm trying to find him, so I thought maybe he he's lost and he don't know where his van's and he's walking on foot or something, so I've been trying to find him, man. I wonder if they told you to step out because they thought you were Dickie, and consider, I, I believe he still has that warrant out for him. Yeah, I, I don't even know why he's got a warrant. Out. He shouldn't even have a warrant out for his arrest. I mean, I think I think it was because of that whole thing where he spit. You remember he spit in the uh, bartender's face. He he already went to jail for that. The oh, last shit. Uh, the last time we went to jail is we were out in the city and we got in trouble for racing our cars at the racetrack. All right, let me go. Let me go talk with them, and I'll I'll, I'll get this whole story straightened out. You're ready, man. Alright, so what was the original reason how, for how do we tell him, over? How do we tell Mickey that? How, how do we tell Mickey that his cousin's 1144? Wait, what? Oh, the birthday of these <laughs> Hey, Griffin. Hey, were you the. Did you pull him over? He's getting food, but yeah. So he wasn't. Do you know why he pulled him over, or like why more, more than anything, why he got at, or why Mickey got asked to step out of the vehicle? <laughs> Kyle, do you know anything about that? No, Griffin, his dinner's done, so he's covering his food real quick. Seven oh two. Was there any other unit that was with 732 with the initial stop with Mickey? <laughs> if you can come back upstairs. Okay, Williams. Next. I mean, obviously, I spit on some wind, so, but I'm trying to, like, RP that. Like, I did what they asked me to. Hey, Mickey, you doing good in there? You need any water or anything? Nah, I'm doing good. I, I got a faucet in here. You got you want any soda or flavored for that water? Nope, I'm good. Oh, man, you know it's me. I'm not trying to do you any wrong, all right? Yeah, I just don't want to go to jail. I got gotcha. you. What if I promised you that I wouldn't take you out of here in cuffs? I mean. Would you come out then? And it, no, no, I don't. I don't want to go to jail. I, all I did is I did what the cops told me to do, threw everything away, and then they pulled me over saying I need to step out. I mean, I, I did what they asked me to do, man. I got you. So is there a way that we could talk, not through a, through a wall? I mean, I don't know. I hear a lot of commotion. I'm scared. Well, just myself and Greasy weren't. Weren't originally on your stop, so we're just trying to figure everything out. You know what I'm saying? 
All I know is I got pulled over at the Yellow Jack and then they searched his car because they smelt something. And there was all the junk and bad food and empty weed bags and open containers from months ago. And I threw it away like they told me to. And then after I threw it away, I left and I got pulled over and they told me to step out. I don't know what's going on. And I, I, I that's why I got scared. It took off. I, I understand, man. But you see, we're kind of in a we're kind of in a pickle here, you know. You, you took off from us. We, we probably... Which is, I'm just trying to help you out, Mickey. I know, but I mean, I tried. I tried to ask him why they wouldn't tell me why they want me to step. I mean, I told them they would have told me exactly what it was. I probably would have stepped out, but they wouldn't. They're scaring me. I, I, just, I just had to leave, man. Hey, Mickey, can that. you hear me? Yeah, I hear you, man. Do you mind if I have one of the officers that actually was a part of that traffic stop that told you to get out of the vehicle come in and talk to you? I mean, he can come up to the door. You mind if I come in? You can come in. Uh, I'll open the door for you. Hold right, on, we'll William. Just stay, just, just stay right Hold here up. by the bathroom door. Here. Mickey, I'm coming in. He's staying out here. All right, man. All right, he's just going to explain the whole... You mind if I prop the door open, make it easier to talk? I, I could probably hear him. All right, Mickey, you hear me? Yeah, I hear you, man. All right, man. You know, I'm not trying to be a dick, man. You know, it's only... I if you are okay with it, if we go down back to that bar, and if we have a word with the bartender here, and we can clear it out, and you apologize at least, and he doesn't pursue any farther, I'm pretty sure you can get out of here with no judgment. I mean, I didn't do anything, man. He's saying that you spit in his face. Allegedly. Alle yeah, he's saying that you really spit in his face. So I, I <laughs> want to know if you are okay with going back to that bar, seeing that what happened. If he's lying, he's lying, you know? So we'll see. We'll see. That's kind of messed up then, because if he's lying, then you guys are here trying to arrest me, and he, he could be lying. I'll be going to jail because he's lying. That's fucked up, man. All right, hold on. I know I have a solution to this. Hey, Williams, can you go uh, tell one of the other officers to go check the camera? Oh shit! Talk to the bartender. Just get his side of the story. Worst case scenario, get a DNA swab. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, looks like Mickey. They're uh, once this hey. we have a lieutenant uh, for state. He's gonna run down to Yellow Jack once he gets his equipment on and everything, and he's gonna check CCTV. I mean, I mean, you don't got to do that. Here, hold on, Mickey. I hate to do this. I gotta go talk to this officer real quick. Yep. So I was one of the uh, 911 stated that a male came inside and spit on the bar. Uh -huh. uh, we were sitting right across the street. I saw his vehicle leave. Uh, Williams was able to initiate a traffic stop on him. And as I pulled up, I told him he's going to jail for assault. Um, and the only reason I knew I know it's Mickey is because we stopped him inside the 24 7. I asked him to clean his vehicle. And then once that 911 came out, I watched him. Uh, take off from the parking lot. <laughs> How we doing, Mickey? Keep talking to me, buddy. Well, I'm doing good, man. Mickey, doing good? Can you just go down there and have a word with the bartender? That is all up, man. I mean... I don't... Oh, but apology goes a long way, man. Hey, Mickey. Yeah. Can I make you a deal, buddy? What's that? I have all of these officers leave this building. Just you and I, you can ride in my passenger seat in my car. We could just take a nice on stroll down to that bar. How about that? You know me. I haven't done you any wrong. Can we do that? I mean, Mickey, if I really wanted to be a dick with you, man, I would have... This pursuit could have ended a whole different way. I could have ended up with you in a car or something I could have pitted you or whatever. I don't hurt you, man. I, I mean... I know you guys don't want to hurt me. I just don't want to go to jail, man.
761 advised, don't mention anything. Uh -huh. Hey, Mickey, cool if I come back in? I, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm getting scared now. Mickey, what if, if I, if no, I no. Negative, you're clear, thank you. Mickey, come on, man. Let me just hop back in there. I just want to speak to you again. I don't know, man. I, I'm getting a little freaked out. No, Mickey, there's nothing to be freaked out about. Yeah, there is. I don't want to go to jail, you man. You didn't do anything wrong, man. That's not what they're saying. You didn't do anything wrong. I can assure you that. I don't know, man. Just let me hop in there and talk to you. I, I just want to make this, you know, I want to make this a good conversation. Uh, I did get word from that, you know, Dickie may or may not be back in town. Mickey, what happened in there? Nah, don't, what was don't, that sound? Don't worry about it. Mickey? I'm stepping away from the door. Mickey, are you all right in there? Yeah, I'm fine. Crazy. Mind if I come in there? I wouldn't. Because you're going to take me to jail. I'm not going to take you to jail, man. I don't know. I'm going to let you in. I, I bet you you're going to tase me and you're going to put me in cuffs. I'm not going to know. I don't have anything in my hand. I can assure you that. I, I can come in with my hands up if that's really what you want me to do. Well, I'm back up. All right, Mickey, I'm coming in, man. I just want to talk to you. I just want to chat. Mickey, why do you have a glass bottle? Mickey, William, pop that door. Shoot that door. Get out of here. I don't want to go to jail. No, Shoot get out of here. Up. Flashbang out. Oh. Ow. I can't Mickey, see. Mickey, I can't see. Up, I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Oh. Uh, I couldn't see. Uh, I was going to put it down. I couldn't see you through that flashbang. <laughs> I know, but you ran at me, man. I'm sorry. I couldn't see. That's why. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mickey. Fuck Mickey. God damn it! I guess it's a bad time to tell him that fucking Dickie's. So no Dickie's dead. Us. Dickie's he's dead. No, he he can't be dead. Give me give me work. Give me give me space. Give me space. Give me space. I got him. <laughs> Uh, he can't be I dead. need I need a med bag I with Chessie. Right, right Thank you. Watch out, Williams. I'm picking him up and moving him so I have more space. <laughs> I'll get this door propped open. Dicky can't be dead. This ain't true. He's in the bathroom. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. I'm setting you on this pool table, Mickey. No, not my pool table. We're going to ruin it. Here, I'm going to do something. Just cough, cough, get on there. Yep. Or just lay somewhere on the ground. That's fine. Right there's fine. You two, I know you're trying to help, but please give me some room. <laughs> oh, you know, just another, another day, another dollar. Damn straight. Williams, you in the bathroom? Grab me a towel. Hey. The doors up. I need to deal with. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be all right, Mickey. Just you know, I'll be all right, Mickey.
Mickey there with me, man? Mickey, keep speaking. Unless you're typing. Damn, you see, I didn't want to have to shoot him. Hey, man, if he tried man, fucking stabbing you. Yeah, that's what it came to, man. Yeah, I was going to try to phase him, and then I was just charging him with that one. I'm trying to see how many fucking gunshots he has. Yeah, yeah. Do we have any lifelight units? Um, uh, I'm sure Justice can hop in a heli. Oh, he's dealing with that McLaren. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it. I mean, I can, I can, I can call a radio. Here, I got you. Um, I mean, if you oh, take over medical, I can run to the station and grab mine. <laughs> know how he has the ability he's not in TSU I'm not gonna talk about it. we need someone life flighted like we need I, the I told you eye. if you take over medical I could ran back to oh, the yeah, station yeah. and grab it Adam four seven six one direct uh, can you come back to the scene <laughs> uh, I've applied chest seal just keep an eye on the bleeding I'm gonna run grab the heli all right. <laughs> what happened to Dicky, man? I don't know, man. I, I wasn't a part of that. I don't know what happened. I just found out that he passed. I I know I know the cops killed Ricky. I don't know nothing about Dicky. I just hope Dicky isn't. I I I know Dicky's in a better place, man. No, nah, no, nah, this ain't true. This can't be happening, man. <laughs> uh, this Don't worry, man. Just stay with me. You're not dying on me, too. I'm going to get you life flighted on out of here to the hospital. This has got to be a dream. He's not dead. Sorry, man. Right? <laughs> Before go ahead. <laughs> They're trying to say Dicky Cheese is dead. There's no way he fucking would kill himself ever. I know Ricky's dead. Hey, we went. Applied more pressure gauze around his chest wounds because I noticed a little and bit more blood coming out. Has he applied chest seal yet? Out of four seven six one, just mark it in the front parking lot. <laughs> Stay with me, Mickey. Don't die on me, Mickey. <laughs> Come on, Mickey. You're not dying on me today. Uh -huh. All you had to do was click it once, Chrissy. Uh, press your X. Press your X muscle, then your F muscle, Mickey.
Go ahead and route him to the pillbox. Uh, Milwaukee Miz. Yep. <laughs> Uh-huh. That one's good luck. Mickey's going to the hospital. It's a nice little trip. Get to see the NVE. Look at this beautiful NVE with all the trees. Ooh. Looks beautiful. That farm that's cool to be looking. <laughs> they told me to throw everything out, so I just threw everything out, man. <laughs> How you doing back there? Uh, <laughs> I know, it hurts. You're gonna hurt for quite a while, Mickey. <laughs> I mean, I know all about Ricky dying, but not Dicky. Unless Dicky hopped in, start role playing when I didn't know he was on. There's no way he's dead. Yeah, let me help you out, buddy. Give me two seconds. I have to remember the command. Let's get you inside, Mickey. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta F. Probably F2 it, bro. Yeah. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. Well, Mickey's in a hospital. So there you have it. Some, some things happened in this video that I didn't expect to happen. But, yeah, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Is Dicky dead? I don't think he's dead. <laughs> My brother would never kill his character off. I mean, if he did, coincidence. I mean, these are our main characters that we play with, that we started with. Why would it be killing? It'd be like our favorite YouTubers, Chuck Livingston, Bay Area Bugs, and Siv Ryan, uh, George, uh, Chuck Mar or, uh, uh, George uh, Marlon, over like the fish, whatever, and Chuck Livingston, like, and... Like, even Sid Ryan, I mean, not Sid, Jeff uh, Fabiano's characters, like, them killing their main characters off. Like, why would they do that? It's their main characters. Like, they ain't gonna kill Mickey off, and I don't think he killed Dickie off. But, is Dickie dead? I don't know. We'll have to find out, ladies and gentlemen. But there you have it. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you all next time when we find out if Dickie's dead. I don't think he's dead, but we'll find out. Later.